Every single day I get to go to work and I do something that hopefully helps make the water that comes out of the tap safer. My name is Nicholas Dugan and I'm an environmental engineer and I've been working for the Environmental Protection Agency for 17 years and um, I perform bench and pilot scale drinking water treatment studies to look at the most efficient and cost-effective way of removing a wide range of contaminants from, uh, from drinking water. Alphatoxins, they are a big problem nationally and um, they show up in at least half of the states in the Union. So it is definitely a nationwide problem and there's a couple of major reasons for why these, uh, these blooms are, uh, are, are harmful. Most freshwater harmful algal blooms are, are caused by a uh, bacteria that photosynthesizes. Uh, they're called cyanobacteria and they, pr they release several different types of toxins. And these toxins affect the body in two main ways. The first is there's one type of toxin that affects the central nervous system, and there's another type of toxin that affects the liver. We as an agency need to understand how these cyanobacteria, how their cells, and also the toxins that these cells produce, how they actually move through a drinking water treatment plant, and where in the water treatment plant in the existing facilities are they most effectively removed. My hope with the algal blooms is that the information that I help to generate is something that practicing consulting engineers and managers at drinking water utilities and will be used by them to work collaboratively to essentially figure out a way to cost-effectively upgrade or change the operation of their treatment facilities to lower the probability of uh, the consuming public coming to harm from, from these toxins. I go to work every day. I know I'm doing the right thing because drinking water, the water that comes out of your tap, is important to every single person in this country.